Hi guys, welcome back to another um, part of this build. So I screwed up. I had the life in engine on there, and when I went to try to hook up um, the regular rectifier to these wires here, I hooked up some wire to the coil wrong and I burnt the coil the um, the engine just shut off and now she won't start so I took it back off I'm gonna have to open it up and see if it it, it is the coil that's messed up and then I have to get a part number and order it in the meantime what I did is I installed my other 420 cc on here to get this thing moving so I actually like the blue better the blue actually lo looks nice so I have to uh, hook up the wires get the electronic ignition working move this up to the front and we're gonna do quite a bit more so I'm gonna get to it So I made this steering wheel here for the um, machine gun Nevis. But I decided to put it on the sexy machine for two reasons. First of all, this steering wheel is no good for the um, machine gun Nevis. Because of the stupid rack and pinion that I decided to put on there, it needs to take more revolution. Uh, so I actually need a round steering wheel for that cart. For this one, the chrome steering wheel was too small. Um, it's only nine and a half inches round. And to control the go-kart, it's really not that safe to be exact. So I decided to put this steering wheel on, on here. Which is it's more sturdy. You can stabilize the go-kart better. A lot better, actually. So now I'm going to make a nice chain steering wheel round for um, Machine Gun Nevis. I'm gonna get to that now.
Cool. Cool. I was gonna try the yellow on the steering wheel. I don't like the yellow. It actually does not go good with the go-kart. So I'm gonna try blue. I'm at the uh, torque converter here. Um, I've heard, uh, I think it was on T Man's go karts uh, uh, live stream. He said, uh, someone asked if uh, people ever have those days that nothing seems to go right. Well, for the past four or five days, nothing has been going right. I've been trying to get this go kart done. And everything seems to be holding me back. First of all, they didn't have a spacer here. I, they didn't send me a spacer. So I had to invent something, come up with something. Then they didn't give me a bolt for here. So I grabbed a, a 3 8 bolt, which was a coarse thread. And as you guys can see over here, it was a coarse thread and I tapped it for the fine thread so it could fit into here and what I'll end up doing is um, I'll end up cutting this piece off here because this is not obviously not strong but this this length here will be sufficient for it anyway yeah like it seems like every little thing is holding me back right now First of all, it was the engine. I blew the freaking coil on the, on my other engine. So, and now I'm just trying to figure out. And now I don't even have a big enough washer for here for this. So today's a holiday, so nothing's open. So I'm gonna try to make a washer. And see if I can get this thing uh, ready to fly. Okay, so even after all the setbacks, I got the torque converter on. Uh, I think I got everything done here. I've been waiting to drive this thing since the day I started building it. It's basically all done. Um, let me see here. I'm going to start it up for a bit. Steering wheel. I like the steering wheel. The steering wheel came out okay. I, I don't know about the blue, but I keep painting everything either black or red. I was going to paint it red, but I decided to try the blue. I'm sticking with the blue for now. She, uh, she ac actually, I like her. She looks like a beast. But, she sounds like a pussy. So, I'm going to, later on, after I do my rides and everything, I need help. Every time you need help, everybody always takes off. So, I guess you guys know what it's like. 
I need help to, uh, I know you guys are going to say good luck, but I will do it, to get this go-kart over that fence. So, um, yeah, but anyway, I like her, the way she looks. She looks mean, but sounds like a pussy. So what I'm going to do is what, I'm going to copy Custom Winder 1. He did um, a nice uh, exhaust system for his um, lawnmower. He made his own custom pipe and everything. So I'm thinking of doing my own custom pipe for this. Anyway, um, if it doesn't rain tomorrow and if I can get some help, I'm taking this thing for a ride. Paintball is gone. Oh, one thing, one other thing I wanted to sh um, let you guys know. I had the switch here for the paintball gun. The problem with that is I ordered two solenoids and both solenoids are not strong enough to um, to pull the trigger on the freaking paintball gun. So I had to eliminate the electric part. So what I did was I ran a cable along here to here. And this is my paintball gun shooter. Just a trigger here to shoot. I I would rather have it on the steering wheel, but that's not possible for now. Like even if I wanted to put this on the steering wheel, it wouldn't work because of the rack and pinion that I put on here. The steering wheel needs too much of a revolution. And the cable, or even the wires, if I wouldn't wire it, would just get tangled up. So it's not, uh, uh, it's not possible to do that. Anyway, like I said, she looks like a beast, sounds like a pussy. We'll see what she does, and then I'll tune her up. I'll see you guys on my next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.